Welcome back to another episode of our FM22 Unknown to Icon series. We have started at the bottom of the English divisions and we'll try to get to the promised land of the Premier League. If you enjoy football management content and want to see more videos like this one, then hit that subscribe button. Hello and welcome to another episode. We are in episode 8. Yes. Nailed it. Got it right. You see, last episode, I was adamant we was in episode 6. Just want to say, this is the final episode of Football Manager 22 for me. Because I'm going to go away and I've got loads of things to work on for Football Manager 23. Thank you very much to all those who have supported, subscribed. We're nearly on 220 subscribers now. Whereas this video goes live, it might be over. My aim for Football Manager 2023 is obviously monetized this isn't my full-time job but it'd be nice to get some beer money so yeah exciting exciting times and i do apologize that if i'm trying things out obviously i've been trying things out for a year but there's always so much to learn who knew there was so much to learn of making a youtube video i'm still learning premiere pro i'm still learning my lighting so you might notice every episode my lighting is slightly off where was we when we left you on the last video we was fourth and then obviously if you go back one more episode we were was unbeaten and we was top of league after 20 games halfway point of the season if you did miss those videos you know what to do there's the link if you've now come back and watched it let's continue our journey and finalize of what we're gonna do is it good story is it good news mm, maybe let's get cracking on this because i've already taken up probably half a video already All right so we are in for fixture screen let's pull up april there we go and it's bad we didn't turn around our season Dorking one all gospel nil nil kingstonian two all frustrating games frustrating when you're trying to turn around your form you just can't get those wins hungerford three two maidstone one one all Oxford City 1 0 and Chippenham 3 0. Wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. You can see our downfall. Look at that. I mean, last video from game 38 to 46. It's just not good. And then we were just stuck in six. Just couldn't pull out of it. Yeah. What a fall. What a fall from the top. Would I have continued making another season if we got promoted? Probably. Probably. It, because we're going to be doing a series earlier in Football Manager 23. There's going to be heartache, but we'll continue. And I want to make as many as I can to really show a journey. But in this one, it just didn't go right. I feel like Football Manager 22 for me has been a nearly there. It's always so close, but I'm just out of reach from achieving what I wanted to do. But yeah, it is what it is. How did our playoff games go? Let's go have a look. All right, we start in for 70th minute and we have a corner. Goddard to take it. Swings it into Hockenau. Ah, oh, unlucky. Thomas gets it back into a box to Sol. Sol gets it into Jeffers and we go 1-0 up in our first round playoffs. It's not semi-final or final playoffs. It is first round, then for semi-final and then playoffs because there's added spaces. Bath gets the ball into, uh, from a corner. Not a very good corner, but Smith gets it to Malon. Krasniki, James. My pronunciation of names is still bad. It's never going to improve. Isam, Jobson. Isam get whipped in the ball. Oh, Cook scores a header. Looped over our goalkeeper. That's 1 all. 79th minute. It's squeaky bum time for us. Oh, no. We get the ball. Wiltshire has a crack and Bath clears it, but not too far. Dawson has a crack. Oh, Dawson saves it. Yes, I'm not just showing goals in this game. Want to just make it a bit more tighter and so with we'll cross. Oh, hocking up. Right. 87th minute. Wiltshire with a free kick. Ah, what a goal. What a free kick, Wiltshire. He has definitely been one of our top performers this season. And it finishes 2-1. We go through to the semi-finals of the playoffs. After winning that, I was rubbing my hands. I was like, yes, you know what? We've won our last two games of the league and we've won our first round of the playoffs. I was like, can we do this? Can we get through? There's not a second leg in this. It's literally just Drew that we was playing them. And then we go into the semi-final. So let's look at stats. Did, did we deserve to win this? They had 15 shots to uh, eight, five on target. AHG was slightly better. They had better possession. Our passing was slightly down. I think for quite a few for games, for the last 10 games, I was using my other formation and it just didn't quite go. I reverted back to my original formation, obviously what got 
got a top of the table for all that time and I won the last two games of the season and I've won this and as you can see that's a formation we're using down here. All right, we're going to our semi-final game. There's only one leg and we're playing away easily. I thought that is really unfair. How was that drawn? I need to have a look into it a little bit more maybe for Football Manchester 23 of how that works out. Is it a draw? Because we played Bath away, we won. And now that we're playing East Fleet away, that's unfair. Why are we not getting any home games? Anyway, run over. Let's see how we do. Right, we're on for 32nd minute and East Fleet have the ball. McDonald back to Casanova. Love that name. Finnegan, McDonald. I bet he gets all the ladies with Casanova, right? Finney, even if he's ugly. How? How can he find it into a box? He does, and it goes to Fondop. Fondop. It's a fun name to say. Fondop. I mean, I can't say anything about my surname. Uh, Casanova with a screamer. Wow, that was a sexy free kick. Wow. 47th minute, and it's 2 0. Can we bring this back? 90th minute now. So nothing really happened because this is on key highlights. We've got the ball. Hockenau, can we do something? Can we produce a miracle to bring this back? Well, shit. Oh, it is all over. Should I say it again? Because I don't know why I keep on saying it. Ladies and gentlemen, we are out and we finished the Exxon League. There's no playoff final for us. Again, last episode, we had a cry already. It's okay, we can cry again. It happens for emotions of football. Take it on, June. Learn from it. We move on. We're going to become that icon. And football manager 23. Come on, we can do this. Stats, shot, 17 to their 7. It was away, man. Yeah. Frustrates me. Anyway, on target, 7 to our 0. We had no shots on target. Our closest one was probably that one up then. XG 1.39 to our 0 0.94. We still got 0 0.94 XG and no shots on target. Had better possession, 52%, and pass completed was the same match on 89%. So that is it. We are finished with this series. It's sad that we couldn't become an icon in two seasons. If we was a top club in two seasons, we was, I don't know, Chelsea, Man United one of those top Premier League clubs and we won the treble we would probably then get that status as icon right but I want to do it from being unknown you know and see what we can do Formal Manager 23 is not far away so if you want to see more content and this series played again but in Football Manager 23 you know what to do I'm not going to tell you that's your choice but if you do thank you very much for supporting my channel and I will catch you on for the next one thank you for watching if you like this video and then continue your journey and watch this one.